Welcome to, this will be part three, painting with an airbrush, and today we'll be doing the final stage, which will be the clear coat. Uh, as you can see, uh, that will be the clear coat we'll be using in this restoration shop. High gloss urethane clear coat. Uh, obviously this is a two-part <coughs> clear, clear on the left, and the hardener on the right. Um, We'll be doing a two to one ratio. Uh, two parts clear, one part hardener. Uh, I won't be adding any reducers or any thinner, just the stuff out of the cans. And I'll be using a the 0.5 needle set, <coughs> and I'll probably crank up the PSI a little bit higher to about uh, 20 PSI just because <clears throat> this is a little bit it is a little bit thicker than a pre-thinned paint so it needs a little bit more help to flow out. Alright so there we have our two parts hardener on the left clear on the right two to one ratio give or take um, close enough so now I'm just, I'm just uh, fix it And we're ready to get started. All right, so there we have it. The body is clear. I'll let this sit for a couple of days and gas out. It takes about a good 48 hours, so for the really strong part of the odor to dissipate and for it to gas out. So in a couple of days, I'll come back, take a look at it, see how it is. Um, I know I got some some debris in there that I, that I need to get out. So I'm gonna wait, let this sit for a couple of days and see how it is. So that was part three. I hope you might have learned something or uh, found it entertaining. I, I hope it was something useful for you to watch. Um, uh, what I'll do is when it gets full, when it's gassed out and ready for handling, I'll shoot a quick video and you can see how it looks. So on that note, thanks for watching.